Knightley's career caught light in 2002 with the release of British soccer comedy Bend It Like Beckham, although the actress herself reviewed her performance in that film as rubbish. Since then, there's been no shortage of opportunity to work on her acting skills, with Kira packing in three films a year. Always laughing and joking on the red carpet, the Pirates of the Caribbean heroine has lots to smile about. In between offers of lead roles in Hollywood blockbusters, she's fielding award nominations, praise for her style and increasing attention as a sex symbol. But if everything in the garden is so rosy, why does she look so painfully thin? Rumours that Kira's coat hanger frame is the result of a chronic eating disorder have always been met with outrage by the actress. Kira has allegedly insisted that her svelte figure can be attributed to half a bottle of wine a night and regular plates of pasta. But when the media speculation failed to die down, she decided to play tough and successfully sued a British tabloid for claiming she'd lied about being anorexic. No, it was really weird. They said that to me yesterday. They went, how does it feel to be always called anorexic? I had no idea that I was. Um, I can safely say that I'm not. Um, I've got a lot of experience with anorexia. It was in my family, hugely. My grandmother and my great-grandmother suffered for it, from it. And I've got a lot of friends at school who suffer from it. So I don't think it's anything to be taken lightly. I suppose, in a way, it's good that it's, it's out there and people are talking about it, because at least for young girls, you know, it's, it's something that's aware. It's quite interesting because it's normally high-achieving young women that suffer from it. So I guess control, f sort of <laughs> control freaks. Um, so, I mean, it's, it's understandable why you'd associate that with, with sort of high-achieving people in, in, a, in the, the film industry as well. And, and I'm not saying that there aren't people that suffer from it, because I'm sure that there are. Um, I'm not one of them.